Good morning, Tiz. How's it going? How are you doing this morning? This m music reminds me of, like, Steven Universe. Hi, Paul. How's it going? Hope you're doing well. I'm not sure what Caltech animation style is. Is that like a California university for animation or something? You're in a super great mood? That's awesome. I'm glad. I was productive today. I got chores done before stream and I like ate well. I don't know who I am. <laughs> like I got the dishes done, my desk is clean, kind of. There's still some junk bills on it, but uh, all all the piles of dishes are gone. The uh, piles of mugs with half drunk tea that's molding away it's all gone it was getting nasty it needed to be done a lot of contemporary animation oh well how about that kind of felt like a bluesy kind of relaxed music today so figured I'd go with that I'm slightly nervous, I will say that. Um, I have an appointment with um, a Catholic- Allie, you are an amazing streamer, and I appreciate you. Hello, hi. Uh, hi, Allie, how are you doing? <laughs> Hope you're doing well. Um, but, yeah, I'm, I have a appointment after stream with a Catholic, um, Catholic priest to discuss me becoming Catholic, which I was raised Presbyterian, which is a Protestant faith, and, um, should be interesting. I have a vague idea what I'm walking into, but I also really don't, because I don't know what I don't know. And I'm trying to walk in with a open mind and kind of see if it's for me. Because, like, I've gone to the church for months. I love the church. I love the traditions. Uh, it's really interesting. So we go to a Catholic service that is held completely in German, except for the sermon. But all the hymns are German, all the responses are in German, and it, I don't know, it just, somehow it, it's a way for me to, like, not just fall into the routine minutia, I guess, you know, like, just saying the words and now I'm meaning them because I have to think about what I'm saying though half the time I don't get through the Lord's Prayer because of the fact that my husband will get messed up halfway through or he doesn't pause at the right point because he can't hear everyone else because he's half deaf so he's like a half a beat behind everyone else or he's half a beat ahead of everyone else so I just give up and I just don't say anything <laughs> but uh it is it is a interesting experience but like we love going to the service because afterwards we go down to the like fellowship area and there there's just beer everywhere <laughs> and um like there there will be these old men just walking around with like six packs handing out free beer and everyone's like super jovial and like friendly and like the first time we were there we were immediately like scooped up and 
taken care of and like everyone was super nice to us and in introducing us around and they like notice when we're not there and um, I'm feeling kind of guilty because I haven't been there in the last three weeks but uh and they always have like birthday shots for people who have birthdays um, or well rather the birthday person brings the shots and then they spread it around and everyone does a shot and um, I don't know it's just it's it's a family it's a really big boisterous German family and I love it it's great and uh, I was kind of wondering how to be how do I feel more of a part of it and they I talked to the nuns I talked to the fathers and they were like well how do you make a friendship with your fellow uh, Catholics other than going through the process to become a Catholic with each other and um, makes sense to me so yeah but that first step is today after stream and um yeah. <laughs> Did I hear free rare? Where can I sign up? You shouldn't be drinking. And you know that, Paul. I will bop you. Um, but anyways, we are doing more of the um, Grim Fandangos today. And it should be fun and interesting and crazy and hopefully I won't get too confused. I do have my um, walkthrough pulled up on my phone just in case I need it. Hopefully I won't. Yeah, you shouldn't be messing depression meds with uh, beer, dude, at all, ever. Like, I got yelled at for doing that. So... I, I will absolutely bop you if you keep doing that. But, um, it's very dangerous. Alright, that is the alarm for, uh, the game times. So give me a second and I'll get us on over. Oop, wrong one. We were doing focused game. Alright, get Glottis tools find Lolo's uh, Lola's photograph we found we found no we didn't find the photograph we found her we didn't find the photograph I'm gonna have to agree with Tiz on that Paul that's still not good you need to take your meds every day uh, at the correct time but anyways we're not here to beat up on Paul. We're here to play a video game and have fun doing it. So, give me a second, and Dad, why are you playing Sea of Thieves? I want to play Sea of Thieves with you. <laughs> Don't do that to me, Dad. Ah! Alright, here we go. <laughs> Okay. Almost there! Tiz, I've already explained why I can't play with him after Come a stream. On, baby needs a new pair of glass packs. Uh, I'm trying to think of if there's anything we need here. Doesn't look like it. You can do it! You can do it. That's a good cat. Oh, whoops. Uh, one second. Game capture. Yes, tis. I get it. Stop yelling at me. I just saw that. You don't have to say it multiple times. Thank you. Je suis désolé. No kitty. All right. And, uh, let's see. Um, because I'm 
not exactly sure where I'm supposed to go from this, so I'm going to check real fast. Okay. So we, I believe, need to go down and... No. This way. There we go. Because we need to go back to Toto's. Because there was something I forgot to do. Because we got a... Um, We got some kind of thing that has, let me double check. Well, we've got the bandsaw, we've got the metal detector, we've got the key, we've got a jacket. All that this paper says is number 36, the rusty anchor. What is that supposed to mean? And I think we're supposed to show that to Toto as well. So, we need to go and uh, talk to Toto and show that to him. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Uh, hang on a second. Does this mean anything to you? You mean beside the song, the poem, and the bar, and the statue by that name? Sure! It is one of my most famous designs. Here, I show you. Let's see, uh, number 30, Harmin Sedge, Harmin Skeptor, Harmin... Ah, 36, here. Hey, what is this? What is what? My friend Lola left that here for me. Oh, oh yeah, uh, Lola was here, sweet girl, like daughter to me. Tell her Papa Toto says hello. Right. Sure. So that was a photograph. Um, let's examine the item. Looks like these cats are almost scruff and scruff. Number 14. 114. I'm gonna go ahead and put that back. Yeah. Narangha is out for the count, I believe. Okay. I think we need to go up to the morgue now. Is the morgue's up this way? I think it is. Orange. I think you're right. This way? It is. I have a sneaky idea. I have way too much stuff. Are you sure you're looking hard enough? Look, Manuel, these old eyes are tired. I'm doing the best I can, but the average retirement age beachcomber has more sophisticated equipment than I've got here. Hmm. I wonder if we give him the uh, metal detector, if that'll help now. Would a metal detector help the cause? Hey, just like downtown. 
You never know what this will turn up. An engraved ring, a belt buckle with somebody's name on it. <laughs> Who would wear a belt buckle with the... Oh. <laughs> Lasco, it looks like I've got one of your boys down here in the morgue. A sailor by the name of... Naranja. What? How? Sprouted? But... Ah, oh, this town's going to hell. Sailor can't even take a two-day shore leave without watching his back. Yeah, yeah, I'll come down in the morning. All day long, Manny, I sought through pure sadness. I find evidence, and I piece together stories. But none of my stories end well. They all end here. And the moral of every story is the same. We may have years, we may have hours, but sooner or later, we push up flowers. Wait, no, no, no. I want to go this way. It is rather morose. I mean, what else do you expect from a uh, mortician? That's the sugar Baba likes. There's uh, more stuff over here. I don't need any cat meat. Is this a... Uh... Oh. What are you doing? I wanted some wine. Oh, look at what a mess you have made. Get out of here. Hey, what about my vino? It's not self-serve. You'll just have to wait until I get around to it. You got it! I wonder if he comes in often? That monster upstairs is running me ragged. Oh, but monsieur, je suis très désolé. There are no guests allowed in the kitchen. I must ask you to leave. In a minute, Leroy. Raoul. Select. No, that's not what I wanted. There we go. Hello? Hello out there? Could somebody please open the door? <laughs> I, uh, <laughs> I seem to have uh, locked myself in this teeny tiny room. I am actually very close to a phobic, so if somebody, uh, s'il vous plaît, s'il vous plaît, oh, let me out of here immediately. Oh, oh, oh. What's that? Hey, I'm thirsty. Where's that waiter? 
that does it! Oh no. Mm, fruity, but voluminous. <laughs> I wonder. Voluminous. The can opener wouldn't work there. Can I get up here? I can. Because I, if you remember back, I'm trying to get into the wine cellar. Yep. Also, never do this, because uh, you will well, pass out due to the wine somebody's fumes. Somebody's sleeping on the job. Ah, it's empty. <coughs> Ruben, where <coughs> are you? Mon dieu! Take a little nap, a vous, eh? Well, le keg is le empty, so too sweet, Buster. Yes, monsieur. Merci anything you say. Hey, Joe, my wine! Oh, I'm going to foul him for ignoring my pleas, and then I believe I shall quit. Oh, I can never look at that pantry again. No man should ever be locked up in such a small, dark place. Sorry, mate. <laughs> Aha. And I'm in the wine cellar now. Sweet. Maybe that's not where I clicked. Uh, I never want to go near another one of those. Okay. Fine. I bet that thing's really easy to control if you're a big demon. Ali, you haven't saved in a while. Please do that. Thank you. what to do further here and uh, 
so I looked at the walkthrough and it says that I have to line the forks up with the gap of the mesh gate so that I don't exit the elevator. There's some kind of hidden floor. So... Oh, yeah, that makes sense. Because, see that mesh right there? That's what I'm trying to get the forks through. Pretty sure. Hmm, no vect. to make sure that I can get out of the uh, elevator. I think I can park it right here. Maybe? hitboxes for where this thing is, um, how far it goes far. Forward. Not here. It won't let me exit, is the thing.
I don't think that's it. Not here. I can't get through this door. Not here. Manny, you're killing me. Not here. Not here. Not here. I swear I'm changing the thing not to here. not here. Not here. Manny, you're killing me. Not here. I can't get through this door. You're absolutely killing me, Manny. Some kind of secret door. What? Oh. Yeah, that that's the door we want to get to, I think. Try what you said. First, I'm going to reset it. Not here. I'm going to kill this thing. Here. All right, far back right corner, correct? For the love of it, everything that is holy, Manny. No, 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 no. Annie, what are you doing? everything. How to turn 
and I can't back it up because every time I click forward it... what are you doing? Money. Full of double end tickets. This could get a hundred souls on the number nine train. Something's not right about this. I get the feeling this suitcase belongs to someone more important than Chow Chilla Charlie. All right, Manny. Give me the case. Charles, I thought we had a bargain. Don't oh, we do? No. But I thought I'd bring some muscle along, just in case. What's the matter, Chuck? Can't afford to hire goons to do this sort of work for you? I'm all the goon I need. Now drop it! You said it, boss. Got a card for me? Here! Welcome to the Union, Manny. Meetings first Tuesday of every month, and, uh... Don't forget to pay your dues. Don't forget to pay my dues. <laughs> and I need to go back this way. I think my next thing is to see if I can get Glottis the tools. Good 
good point. Uh, let's go ahead and go done on that. So, what are you guys doing to free Terry? Hmm, guess it's up to me. Is there anything else at the lighthouse? They look busy working up a plan to free Terry. They look busy working up a plan to free Terry. I wonder if Nick is back. Or wait, what was that picture? It's Lola's jacket. Back to the racetrack. I'm a union man now. Yes, yes, ma'am. Oh, marry me, Olivia? It says marry me, Olivia. And six and six. Number 114. That's, that's a fair point. I might go ahead and, uh, See what she has to say about that. I don't think that would shed any light on things. Really? I don't think that would shed any light on things. Apparently not. What's happening Wait, what? to this town? Oh, big city crime, Manny. We're getting more of it every day. I know you probably hate getting it this way, but Naranja's job's yours now. No, Velasco, I don't know if I'm comfortable taking that. You'll take his job because there's no one else I can get on such short notice. And the card? Let me see it. Oh, oh, oh one of Charlie's rush jobs. Good thing your new captain's far-sighted. And don't forget that Gladys has got to bring his own tools. He will. He doesn't go anywhere without a lot of tools. Good. Because neither does the limbo. Don't just sit around here collecting barnacles. Right. Okie dokie.
the guy up here? I don't think that would shed any light on things. Okay. Anybody there? I told you, we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday! Kitty hats for Tuesday. We do have the printing stuff. Me and this ticket printer, we're gonna make a mint. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday, week six, race six. Anybody there? Let's see if this works. I told you, we don't give out the kitty hats till Tuesday. Here. Oh, another Chowchilla Charlie original. Give me one good reason not to throw you out of here. Because I'll tell Max to fire you. didn't do much. Maybe if I go back in the high roller club? Pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad, pretty bad! You're doing it! I don't think it would be a good idea to barge into Max's office while he's meeting with Nick. Oh, for crying out loud! Go, Kitty! Puss, 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 puss! Meow, baby! Get that mouth! Oh, for crying out loud! Apparently, we don't have the betting stub anymore. Get that mouth! Pause in the air! Let's go! Gladys, could you be any more annoying? <laughs> yeah, I'm not surprised the guy took it either. Is another bedding stub area. Uh, let me print out another. Got way too much stuff in here now. Betting stop, please. Here you go. Hey, this looks different than our usual ticket. Well, that's because it's from uh, last season. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. It's just a bunch of cats. Yeah, but look how fast they're running. Ah, oh. sorry, sir. I'm sure you'll be a winner next time. Hmm. Interesting. Well, I'm not sure that that is what I'm supposed to do. I'm gonna go check on Terry. So that's the guy we gotta talk to, though. Oh, 
that's right, I gotta go up to get that. for cargo stolen from shipyard receiving area, including a large suitcase bearing the initials HL. Which is probably what we saw. How you holding up, hero? Manny, you gotta get me out of here. I'm a victim of society. I'm working on it. Poor Terry, this is all my fault. Okay, so we can't talk to Chief Borden or whatever his face is. Doesn't seem like. The sand spoof? I suppose. Spoof was the uh That was the stuffed cat, right? Wait no, down this way? Please. Beloved Sandspoof, this regal and majestic feline was a record holder for speed and a favorite of the crowds here in Rubacava for many years until her career was suddenly and tragically cut short on the second week of the racing season when the airship Olivia One, on its maiden voyage crashed onto the track mid-race and exploded. Many bereaved fans testified later that before the blimp hit, Sandspoof was in the lead. Okay. So... Printer. Uh, so that was the second week It was Tuesday. And what number was Sand Spoof? I will in a second. Say what number 114? I'm gonna go ahead and save while I'm remembering. No, because uh, Tuesday is kitty hat, or er, is kitties. One Monday four, maybe. Let's 
so it has to be Tuesday, but... Yeah, that's what I need to check. The heck is going on with the music? Ugh. That was messing with my ears there. Did it print it out? There we go. Okay, race day... Or, er, race week day. Okay, so... We know the day is Tuesday. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday week... Two, race, four. Beloved Sandspoof, this regal and majestic feline was a record holder for speed and a favorite of the crowds here in Rubacava for many years until her career was suddenly and tragically cut short on the, the second, second week, week of the racing season when the airship Olivia won on its maiden voyage crashed onto the track mid-race and exploded. Many bereaved fans testified later that before the blimp hit, Sanspoof was in the lead. Right. So I'm gonna... So it was race six. So race weekday. I'm writing that down. Race, week, day. So that I can remember it because it goes out of my head the minute I switch items. So what I need is race six, Tuesday, week two. There we go. Whoops. Now I need to go back up. It's a betting stub for, let's see, Tuesday, week six, race two. Yep. No, that's fine. Yeah, you're wrong. Hello. That was correct. Oh, hi. Betting stub, please. Here you go. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Cats again? Sorry, sir. I'm sure you'll be a winner next Cats? time. Did I pull out the wrong one? So, maybe I switch it? So, it was... Race six. Would it be this one? 
six. And then this is two. Hello? Oh, hi! Betting stub, please. Here you go. All right, just a second. <laughs> there you are. Aha! What? Are you a winner? Big winner. Thanks, pal. Glad I could help. Okay, so I put something in my jacket. Oh, hello. I wanted to look at that. It's Lola's last work. A juicy photo of Nick and Olivia kissing. So... I need to go back this way to the High Roller Lounge. Ali, I'm you haven't saved in a while. Please do that. I literally was about to. I think that guy was up to something. Don't you, Doug? <laughs> Doug? Who? Oh, that guy? Personally, I think he was nuts! <laughs> this is it! Almost there! It's Lola's last work, a juicy photo of Nick and Olivia kissing. Look what I found at the photo finish booth. Looks like Naughty Kitten and Bad Tomcat are neck and neck. What do you want? I want to tell you a sad story of a young man unjustly imprisoned merely for speaking his mind. It's time to shake up the hive! I guess our business is settled. Almost. <clears throat> what? Was that for the photo, girl? No, that was just for being you. I don't have time to get you for Lola, but I'm sure somebody will. You didn't have time to save her either, but don't feel too bad about that, Manny. I hear saving women really isn't your forte. Oh, that's low. That is so low. That is so mean. And we're gonna take a break on that. <laughs> Okay. Yeah, heck with that guy. Alright. So. Now, let's go back to where the bees are. See if we can get some tools for Gladys. Hell no, we won't work! Hell no, no we, we won't, won't work! Bogan is a big fat jerk! Bogan is a big fat jerk! jerk. Hell no, we won't work! Hell no, no we, we won't, won't work! work. Bogan is, is a, a big, big fat, fat jerk. jerk! Manny! Do it in time, alright? Okay, Sorry. from the top! Hell no, we won't work! Hell, Hell no, no, we won't, we won't work. work! Bogan is a big fat jerk! Bogan, Bogan is, is a big, big fat, fat jerk. jerk! Hell no, we won't work! Hell no, no we, we won't, won't work. work! Bogan is a big fat jerk! Bogan, Bogan is, is a big fat jerk! jerk. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies! No more lies! No more lies! No more lies! Manny! Oops. Do it in time, alright? 
sorry. From the top. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. Sea bees. Sea bees. Free bees. Free bees. Sea bees. Sea bees. Free bees. Free bees. We're strong. We fight. We're killer bees. Manny. Ah, dang it. Do it in time, all right? Okay. Sorry. From the top. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan, Bogan is a big fat jerk. jerk. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we are bees or are, are we flies? flies? No more lies. 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 Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies! 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 Sea bees! Sea bees! Free bees! Free bees! Sea bees! Sea bees! Free bees! Free bees! We're strong! We fight! We're killer bees tonight! All right! We're strong! We fight! We're killer bees tonight! All right! All right! We won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. No more lies. Are we bees or are we flies? Are we bees or are we flies? No more lies. No more lies. No more no lies. lies. No, no more lies. lies. Sea bees. Sea bees. bees. Free bees. Free, free bees. Sea bees. Sea bees. Free bees. Free bees. We're strong. We're strong. We fight. fight. We're killing right. bees. Manny. Ah, uh, dang it. Do it in time, all right? Okay. Sorry. From the top. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Yeah. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Hell no, we won't work. Hell no, we won't work. Bogan is a big fat jerk. Bogan is Um. You know what? I think I can do without that accommodation. I think I need to go up actually to our cafe. Bogan still here? I thought he left. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos chers s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, I Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Oh, I'm still mad, but nothing cheers me up like winning. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, betting is closed. No more bets, please. Okay. 
So let's see, how do we get Glottis out of the High Roller Lounge other than cutting... we could cut off his funds. I bet if we get our uh, casino closed down, he'll have no more funds. Le numéro gagnant, le 16, rouge, Berlemang, 16, red. Mesdames et messieurs, faites vos jeux, s'il vous plaît. Ladies and gentlemen, please place your bets. Mesdames et messieurs, rien ne va plus. Les jeux sont faits. Ladies and gentlemen, betting. No more bets, please. Fourteen. Fourteen is the winner. Le 14. Numéro 14 est le gagnant. I think you mean two. Am I correct? Uh, no, monsieur. Fourteen is the winner. I think you've made a mistake. I'm sorry, sir. Fourteen is the winning number. Better luck next time, eh? That does it. That calavera is getting too big for his britches. I don't like raiding businesses and shutting them down. But someone's got to teach Manuel a lesson in law and order. Or someone's just a sore loser. Stay back here! Open those paddy wagons up and start filling them! And somebody find Calavera! I want to interrogate him personally. Raided? How long are they gonna close it for? Ah, yeah, you better cut off the big guy's credit then. Yeah, yeah, throw the drunk out on his big orange butt. And bring me Calavera so we can talk about his debt. Hey, come on! You gotta let me back in! I'm a VIP! Does that stand for very inebriated pianist? Oh, many. I don't want to be a pianist anymore. I'm a mechanic. I know. That's why I got you a new job. Come on, let's go pick up your tools. There we go. I can do whatever I want to the engine? Make it faster? Sure, but you'll be plenty busy just keeping her afloat. Thanks for the gig, and for not asking too many questions. Hell, after what happened in Naranja, I can see why you'd leave town. Let's just hope I don't have to go fishing you out of the drink again. I'll stay under next time, I promise. And we're underway. Beautiful sky. One year later. Oh wow. <laughs> Man, Gladys. <laughs> I tell you what, Manny can do anything with Gladys on his side. Captain. Captain Calavera? Captain! Puerto Zapato, sailor! We're here at last! Beautiful port, isn't she? Yes, sir. Well, there's some customs officials down below, sir. They want to search the ship. Fine, fine. We've got nothing to hide, eh? No skeletons in our closet. <laughs> yes, sir. Secure the bow, boys. Like a rock this time. Manuel. Salvador? I hope this very urgent message gets to you in time. Our man in Zapato says Miss Colomar never made it to the port. It said she threw herself overboard at the Pearl. I don't know if you believe that. Whatever you do, do not land in Puerto Zapato. It's a trap. Assassins will attempt to board your ship disguised as customs agents. Beware, and viva la revolución! Uh-oh. Uh, okay. I am going to save. Just checking over the notes of the walkthrough because it's got some bold in it. Please manual save every so often. 
uh, save before you get on the crane. It's right above the conveyor belt. If you're not using a guide, don't have any item equipped when using the crane. Okay. Because there is a glitch that people have suffered with the crane on year three. Okay. I will keep that in mind. Henson. That's a lot of uh, sprouted people. Who's that? I'm right sorry, there? I led you into trouble, sailor. I don't want to go down there, but I oh, don't seem to no. ha have any other options. <laughs> This can't be happening. Hey! He's back here! Sack him! Custom officials, open this door! Yeah, we wanna check your bags. Don't worry, Captain. We're safe in here. Okay, let's just set the explosives and get the hell out of here. <laughs> His face. <laughs> um. Can I pick up the... Where is the... I think the best way to use this engine would be the controls over there, How as opposed to the, the hands-on method. I'm trying to, but he won't let me. There we go. Oh, there's two buttons. The hell? Talk to you. Hello. Yeah, I do this. I've got an idea. I gotta move this ship to the left. I wonder if I can. So left anchor is dropped. We have moved to the left. Uh, if I... Drop and then raise that. Oh, did you see that? There we go. They're locked together like plastic monkeys from a barrel. Okay. Now I need to see if I can use this. Let's 
Well, Perhaps. there you go. Now, if I raise that, that's going to tear the ship. Gladys, in. cover your ears. Let's tear the ship in two. What was that? The dotted line, buddy. And let's move forward, I guess. And we make our escape. Sleeping with the fishies. It's the SS Lola. Just a little farther, Gladys. Mira, snap out of it, sailor. Easy for you to say, you don't have lungs. Hey, you live without your heart once, so you can live without air for a little while. Just until I figure out what we're gonna do. <laughs> gonna save. Um, that's a thing. Beware, brave <coughs> captain! Here in the darkest <coughs> depths of the Sea of Lament dwell the most horrible monsters of all! The fearsome, murky demons of the deep will swallow you whole the instant you leave this pool of light! Heed my warning, or take one step forward and learn for yourself! All right, all right, I believe you. Just quit it with the creepy spirit of the land voice, huh? <laughs> Here comes one now! Ah. Hello. Híjole, he looks like he's been down here a long time. Okay, that might not have been a sea monster, but it was pretty spooky. We could have talked to him, though. I wonder if he shows up again. According to our map, I think that's the pearl. Oh, there he is again. Come back! You all right? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Hang in there, Mano. I have a feeling that guy will come back. Not blue yet. <laughs> not blue yet. According to our map, I think that's the pearl. Come on, dude, show up. Oh, there you are. Amigo, hey, I'm talking to you.
walking toward the... Uh, According to our map, I think that's the Pearl. I'd definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. I'd definitely go over there first chance I get, but there's a lot of dark water between here and there. Stop hiding behind Manny. Er, not Manny. Stop hiding before... behind Glottis. You alright? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny. Not of the sea. Hang in there, Manu. Is there anything else we can do other than talk to the dude? There is. Oh, there he is. Come on, let me talk to him. Amigo, hey, I'm talking to you. Way to enter. I don't have my thing to. I don't have my items! Yeah, our, my item icon is gone. Smoking underwater. <sighs> Can't do that. Amigo. Huh? Ooh. Oh, geez, another shipwreck. You see? That's why I never travel by boat. We've had a little accident. Think you could help us out? Depends on what kind of help you're looking for. Could we borrow that light for a second? Sorry, I'm kind of attached to it. <laughs> could you take us to the Pearl? You don't believe those old stories, do you? You think somewhere in this ocean there's a gigantic pearl that shines so brightly it can be seen from passing ships? And that sometimes sailors so allured by its luster actually fling themselves overboard to dive for it and are never heard from again? Yeah, and I think it's right over... Bah! I've been walking this ocean for years. I ain't never seen it. No, really? The pearl is right over there. You poor sucker! That's the moon! Tell me you didn't come all this way out here to pearl dive the moon! <laughs> what are you doing down here? Trying to get out of the land of the dead, same as everybody else. Why are you walking instead of taking a ship? Got sick of waiting around Rubicava for a boat. Figured I'd make better time this way. Why didn't I think of that? How do you know where you're going? See the moon over there? I just keep it on my right. That way I know I'm heading in a straight line. But oldest trick in the book. Is everything okay with your eyebrows? Them is barnacles, genius. I don't move fast enough to shake them, so they tend to pile up. I don't mind, though. They're the only company I got. <laughs> Hate you, boys. <laughs> How long have you been down here? Well, let me put it this way. I wasn't always this color. Shouldn't you have hit dry land by now? I'm trying to cross a big ocean here, Sonny. What do you know about it? I've already done it. In a boat. A boat? Don't talk to me about boats. What's the problem with boats? We had such a nice boat. Why is everybody always talking about boats? You got a perfectly good pair of legs. Why not use them, I say? Let me guess. You died in a boat wreck. A boat wreck would have been better than what happened to us. Led off course by bad equipment, lost for weeks, no food, no shelter from the sun. We'd started throwing the dead overboard. 
But then the sharks began following the boat. Thanks. What happened in the end? What happened was, I learned three valuable lessons. Stay away from boats. When it comes to navigation, trust only the moon and the stars. And when there's only two of you left, never, ever go to sleep. How have you kept that light going all these years? Well, I found this coral, this glow-in-the-dark coral. Damnedest thing. Glows like a lightning bug and never seems to wear out. I had some of that once. Made a nice grappling hook. I don't think you had what I got, because I don't think you've been to the place where I got it. Where'd you get the coral? Edge of the world, boy. That's the only place it grows. Could you send for help? Oh, sure! I promise to call for help at the next phone booth I walk by. Yikes. Well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. Watch out for sea monsters. Who? These guys? Ah, jeez. Oh, they don't mess with old Chipito. I'm too bright for them. <laughs> this little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine. Hey, lay off! Let go! Let go! Let go! Get your own lamp, pal! Whatever happened to the code of the sea? Yikes. You all right? I'm a spirit of the land, Manny, not of the sea. Hang in there, Manu. I think we're gonna wait for him to come back and Mass to go with him. <laughs> I got an achievement, though. I wasn't always this color. That was quite the scary, uh flash of uh, sea monsters, though. It's scary. That was a lot of them, too. Just waiting to chomp our bones. And we don't have many of those. I mean, we've got a decent amount of bones. He's gonna realize that uh, he's going around in circles. He should be coming around in just a second. There we go. Amigo, hey, I'm talking to you. Amigo, hey, I'm talking hey. to you. How did I get him to stop before? Ugh. Give him to Gladys. I'm gonna go ahead and save though. Yeah, we're easier to munch because of all of our bones. hard to grab but he is amigo what more survivors i just passed another shipwreck not five minutes ago could we tag along with you 
Well, it's a long walk you're talking about. We don't have any other choice. Oh, all right then. Lift those knees, stick close to my light, and try to sing in key. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine, let it shine, let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed, no. I'm gonna let it shine. Hide it under some seaweed. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Scare away, away sea, sea monsters. monsters yeah. yeah, I'm gonna let it shine. Scare away sea monsters. Yeah, I'm gonna let it shine. Scare away sea monsters. Yeah, I'm gonna let it shine. 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 Let it I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. I'm not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Not gonna let you touch it. No, I'm gonna let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. Let it shine. I feel like this was a mistake. I thought that looked like our ship. That's just a trick the ocean plays on your mind, kid. Makes it. Well, this isn't the kind of progress I was hoping for. Oh, well, the wet march of the soul ain't for everybody. Well, I don't want to break your stride there. Okay, see you around. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. This little light of mine, I'm gonna let it shine. Hey! <laughs> What am I supposed to do with this? Follow me. Where are you taking me? To the moon. <laughs> there we go. Benny, is that... The Pearl! <gasps> Me! I knew I'd find her someday! I'm rich! 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 Shh! Something's happening. Benny, what's going on? I don't know, but I don't like the way that thing's looking at us. I'm not going down there while that, that octopus is tracking us. I had no idea their eyesight was so good. There's no talking to octopuses. No talking to octopuses. Not picking that up. Not picking that up. We do have items again. That's interesting. Not quite as famous as the Pearl is the slimy barnacle covered old rock of legend. Hey, lay off! The heck? Lego! 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 Hey, where are you going? You can't leave me here all alone! Come back here! Oh no. We used him as bait. She's coming back. Except the edge! 
Oh. Oh no. That looks like a slave camp. Manny? Don't ask, carnal, because I don't know. Yeah, it doesn't look uh, too good. I'm gonna sneak inside and look for Mechi. What if that octopus comes back while you're gone? Poke him in the eye and steal his sub. Hey, stupid octopus. <laughs> make the octopus, or the, make the sub super awesome. Looking at the time, it is about time for us to uh, cut off things for the day, so I think I am going to go ahead and save again. And I will, uh, we will pick this up again on, uh, what's today? Today's Saturday, so we'll pick it up again on Tuesday. I'm glad you think so. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah. Damn, ready? Yeah. All right. We got a lot done. That that was a lot. And is it just me or does Manny just have a knack for like taking over whatever he's at? Like, he took over the diner and turned it into a casino. He took over the boat and turned it into, like, a major boat. Like, major good-looking boat. But, I mean, you could argue that that was partially because of Gladys doing his stuff. But, uh, it just seems kind of insane. Kind of cool, but kind of insane. Don't Let's see if the mass bomb works now. <coughs> yeah, he really can turn everything into a million bucks. Hey, I mean, if. Well, I mean. Okay, let me rephrase. Because I was about to say, if a man went out of his way to do that kind of stuff for me, I'd fall in love. But then I thought about it for a second, I was like, wait a minute. I do have a man that does that kind of stuff for me. And I'm married to him. So what am I talking about? Granted, I've never been, uh, you know... I've never been... kidnapped or, like, lost forever, so... Thank you for the hug. But uh, anyways, we should have stream as usual on uh, Tuesday. Sorry about Thursday. I had to kind of choose where I was going to allocate my um, energy. And uh, so I did what I had to. But... Uh, I'm really hoping that this week will be normal. I can always hope. It may not always happen, but I can always hope. But anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed the stream. I hope you enjoyed uh, watching this uh, game, this crazy game. And uh, we will pick it up again, like I said, on Tuesday. And when you get to it, my friends, have a wonderful weekend, my lovelies. And stick around after the credits to stick uh, to join the raid to the next streamer.